All right, welcome back to another episode of Life in the Woods. We did some work today. We are in the middle of the trees over here, and I just saw a victim over here. I want to go get. I gotta find him. There he is, right there. Fuck up. Not a bit of string, I don't think. Nope. But I got a spider eye. Hardy morsel. Spider. Okay. So anyway. Um, if you're wondering, I am out here in the middle of uh, my new tree farm. Along with my cricket buddies. We're always out here, so it's pretty thick out here in these woods. Uh, I did lay it out. I did lay it out like in a five pattern. Like boop, 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 down through here. But. I don't know how they got there. But. And life in the woods, what happens is that once these tree leaves fall down, they fall down, they grow sprouts around them. So what was kind of a clean tree farm is now an overgrown freaking patch of greatness. This is totally beautiful. And I do have a surprise today, something I normally don't do on Minecraft, which is weird. But I don't normally build that much. But today... The little plan I had over there before, I actually did do a little building today. It's it's just in the rough form right now. I haven't done any like crazy decorations on it or anything, but I have. I think it looks pretty nice. It's going to be pretty nice. Uh, it could go both ways. It could go a warehouse for storage, or it can go towards a house. Who knows? Um, but yeah, I've been doing a lot. <laughs> A lot of work for me. I normally that's why I normally don't do it because I don't like to build. It takes like all day to do just one building, which I guess makes sense. I mean, I like I said before, I can build. I just don't normally like to build because I'm not the greatest. I'm not the best. And you know, building is more for show. It's not really for function. I would say some of the stuff is for function. You see, this is all overgrown now. Uh, we still got this tower of power over here. Uh, let me see something real quick, though. Just got to check something. Uh, bleh. I am missing something. I am looking for it. And it's not, not on the computer, but elsewhere. Hmm. Well, I guess I'm just going to have to go without it today. Okay, so anyway. Um... Uh, Something I normally don't do, and I don't want to show it. I don't want to spoil it right away. Um, so let's go. Let's go see some other things I did too during the day. These are all grown up. I don't know why these two don't grow. Let me go check those. Blech. Maybe because they have grass right there, right? That should help. Okay, so we fixed that problem. Um, oh, another thing I did too. Remember, I said I had all them things made up. I had this juicer. I had that a while ago. And I, so I made me some melon juice. It's an unfulfilling snack, so I don't know what it does. But I can make all kinds of juices and stuff. So let me show you. Juices, look at this. Insane amount of juices, so... Apples, melons, carrots, strawberries, oranges, blueberries, cherries, all kinds of stuff. So, kind of where we are with that. Yeah, I'm gonna drink me a little bit. Okay, so there we go. Got me some melon juice to go. Doesn't take much to just melon slices in the juicer. You got plenty. So, let me show you how. Real quick. Alright, just a little. Bring it up here, put that back up. Back up. Right there. Get some more melon juice. Bang. There we go. Let's save one of these. Alright, so I can do that with anything like the blueberries, carrots, all that stuff. I can't get pumpkin juice though. I don't understand why I can't get pumpkin juice. But yeah, the apple trees are going real well. You can kind of see a little bit of what I just 
built over there. Uh, let me show you this. I went ahead and finished this out. This is all going to move. Every bit of this. So hopefully it stays upgraded when I move it. This is all going to go behind me in my new storage building or house. I haven't decided yet what I want to do with it. If I want to make it a storage or a house. So actually let's do it from from this side because I think this will give it the best view. And, it's, and remind you it's not complete. Give me just a sec, be right back. Okay, so now for something I don't normally do but I want to show you guys what I've been working on. Now remind you, mind you I haven't changed a lot of the coloring on it so I'm gonna put different material in different spots so I just I got the basic layout work of it or what I want so don't judge it based on the finished product because it's not finished so let me here you go not that but this right here this is gonna be probably my new storage area no, I do think okay so it's just and I'm gonna change the the material on this so don't don't it looks a little rough from, it looks all one color, one shot. Um, just with the basics though, there is a little depth already there. So, I worked a little bit with the carpenter stuff to try to get some different things going. So I still got to work with that. These crickets are driving me effing mad, dude. Effing mad. But I got to move the portal and I'm going to take down this little shack over here. Take that out of the way. Uh, but this is what what I've been building, so it's nothing special. Got some little little triple roof design thing got going. I'm still working on this area, and I got to do all the the pathways and the and the landscaping around it. Which, if you remember my last one, I was talking about landscaping is a lot to do with the looks of a of a build. Uh, this I'm not too sure of. I have like vents and stuff at the top. I might just wait to get a metal or get an iron grate, an iron trap door and do those, but it's not figured out. I'm probably going to close that in and then do a, like a vent here, or just in that one spot. Okay. thought I heard some, I could have swore something was moving behind me in the water. But um, yeah, that's, that's generally what we've been doing, and these are carpenter doors. So I'm going to change those up. I can do whatever I want with them. So like like this, right? I can change them all up. And I can also put the different materials on them. Of course, it's going to be nighttime. Dude, I swear it's like nighttime every freaking five minutes in this game. I get like no time during the day to do anything. But um, yeah, so let's go ahead and sleep real quick. Okay, so as you can see, I mean, it's kind of a nice, it's a nice look. I like it. I mean, it's not, I know it's not the greatest build, but like I said, it's not the finished product. Uh, we got both sides going. I don't know if I want to wrap this around or not. We'll see. I'll try to make it the same, both sides. That's kind of what we're looking at. And hold on just a second. So okay, so that's what I got. Um, now remember, I'm going to change the some of the materials and the design of this. But this is the general layout that I wanted on the outside. It's not crazy. It's, it's still a little detailed. I mean, it's not oversimplified. It's got some depth to it. Um, and once I do the landscape around it, you'll see this all come together. Probably gonna put like, um, you know, them things that go right here on the windows. <laughs> but um, the inside is not done yet, so we will get to that. But right now, it's a pretty high ceiling. So now, if I do this as a storage, I swear these crickets, man. Look at that piece of quiet. Of course. Can't have it for more than two seconds. Um, if I do this for storage, there's going to be storage blocks all the way across here on the walls. Do a stack here. 
I'll probably run it all the way up this wall here. Put the controller somewhere in here. Um, do the same thing on the, the outside wall and probably do a middle row of, of storage. So that's probably what I would do if I do a storage. Now if I do this as a house, I might actually put more windows down here. And then maybe split this off. I don't know if I can really split that. I don't think I'd have to probably dig down. Like drop it down a level. That way I have a three and then use a like a little little stairwell or something here to get up to another level. Have the upstairs. And we can do that. Let's see. And if we have these are like the little entry doors or entryways. So I can do a little bit in here and do some decoration, maybe set up a, a side kitchen or something. Or set up the kitchen and dining area down here, a little living room, and then put the bedrooms upstairs with like a a library or something up there. So I can I can do all kinds of stuff with this. I really can. And right now you notice it's changing the door, door frames. But it'll do that all the time. That's the only thing about carpenter's door, so no matter any time you freaking change it it's going to be a different freaking thing I'm, i think um yeah this is going to have to move though because it's, it's definitely in the way but other than that that's uh that's what i've been working on so i don't think it's that bad maybe i'll do this black granite cobblestone on the top who knows i'll definitely try out some things we'll see what it looks like how it's going to operate can't jump to save my life that's what I'm gonna be doing with that um, if I if you haven't noticed either I gotta I gotta finish this so I've been working on that a little bit I'll show you basically the way I'm doing it doing this here is what I gotta do so let's go ahead and do that real quick should be able to get that going um, or not. Nope, not gonna be able to get under there. Okay, so we'll do it from the top. Go. Okay. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. So that actually, I thought I had finished that part already, but apparently I didn't. I need to do the other side too, and I might do that in between the windows. It depends. Like I said, it depends on what I want to do with it. Same kind of setup here. I think I missed that one. Let's see, I think I gotta do one more here. Yep. Dang. Okay. That's the only thing with this. It's like a, that's why I don't the building thing. It can definitely be a pain in the butt because you gotta get up and down, make sure everything's good. You know, if you miss one little spot, I know I probably could put the stuff behind there. The other thing too is I noticed with this one, you see the light leak through? Ah, I'm not a big fan of that. I'm going to have to figure out a way to deal with that issue. Probably by putting another block up there, but it's already there. So, right, so that'll take care of that. We go to the other side. All right, I gotta fill this in too because this is crazy. Every time you come around the corner of the house, you gotta jump into there. Okay. That's where I always do that. Okay. All right, I'm definitely gonna. Probably definitely change out the windows to a single frame. Not a big fan of the dual frames. Alright. So, anyway. I think what we're going to do on the, when we do our next little project is going to be doing a lot of the landscaping around this. I didn't mean to throw that. Hit the Q button. 
just doing landscaping around this get this all fixed up I gotta finish this this uh, river wall here river walk and everything else so that's pretty much where we're at with things uh, this did take a while though honestly because I had to get all the material that's what I'm saying usually I like to get all the materials built up first before I do any building projects because if not you're like building running out have to go back come back go back come back go back it just it's just a pain so I like to get all this stuff together first before I do any of that is there anything else that happened or was happening uh, oh and I think also that what I need what I want to start doing is doing some exploring I want to see if I can find anything man there should be like buildings and stuff around but I don't know don't know I wish it would show your house no. um see I have it there's so much I haven't looked at anything You know, this is where, this is where I got all the trees built up. This is the house here, the farms. So, anyway. So I guess this is going to be a little bit of a shorter one. I think I'm going to go over here and get all this wheat. Ah, I knew better than that. Ah, I knew better than that. For real? Okay, well, I'm I'm a dummy at times, so yeah. Wow. Really, I'm not that bad at this game. <laughs> I mean, it may you may think so, but I'm not that bad. Yeah, and this is this is for the bread. So this is why I don't run out of food because. All this wheat here, it's a massive amount of bread. The bread's pretty decent, so if I need it, just hit that. Yeah, because all this stuff's going to get moved out back the other way. Of course, not even nighttime. It looks like nighttime. Okay. So, as of for now, though, I guess that's pretty much going to take care of what's going on. Um, I have. I used to play a game back in the day called. It's ROTK3. Um, some of you probably know that. It's uh, Romance of the Three Kingdoms 3. It's always been named 3 or something, or 13 or whatever. I think it's 13 now, or 11. It don't matter. There's so many out there. But I've been playing a little bit of that. I don't know if you guys want to see any of that. Let me know. And I can, I can post a few of those. But if not, then you know, I'll just keep playing it on the side. So I honestly play like at least 5 or 6, 7, 8 games differently. Some of them I don't even record, so um, that's that's what I do a lot of. So if you guys if you guys want to see anything that kind of fits in my genre, you know, if you've been watching me a while and you know what I know what I like to play, then give some suggestions. I'm not saying I'll I'll play them, but you know, I know the series Son of Sam one was out there and stuff, but it's 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 all right. But I just haven't got back to it lately. I've been doing Fallout 4, uh, Romance of Three Kingdoms, uh, Minecraft, Regular, and uh, Life in the Woods. Uh, I do have some some secondary stuff I do with like the the early access games I've been doing. Um, there's a few others too. I mean, so if you if you guys have any suggestions or anything like that, then I will definitely at least give it a look. I may not record it, but I'll give it a look. But I want to thank you guys for watching, and we will see you on the next one. Bye-bye.